you know, society rewards overconfidence. We want our leaders to be overconfident. I mean, if they told us the truth about the uncertainty, we would discard them in favor of other leaders who, who, who sort of give an impression that they know what they're doing. We want overconfidence. We support it. We sustain it. And there is an awful lot of it. I mean, most of what we read in the paper is overconfidence. Sometimes it's catastrophic. You have to distinguish the perspective of the individual from the perspective of society. I think for society, it is probably very good that we have a lot of optimistic entrepreneurs I mean, you know, who think they will succeed, although most of them fail. And most of them really do not know the odds. It is not true that they know the odds and they take the risks willingly. M many of them, most of them probably, do not know the odds. From the point of view of the individuals, it is not always good to be optimistic. For example, I have no interest whatsoever in my financial advisor being an optimist. You know, I don't care for that. For an entrepreneur, it may be a good thing to be an optimist because it will make him or her uh, persevere more. We know that being an optimist is useful under some conditions. It is not always useful in making decisions. <laughs>